<laughs> oh, we're talking about making Kool-Aid. Good life, good food with Chef Bug. Bug, good to see you after a good week to be away. Back. I haven't I seen her in like it's three been a weeks. Long time. It's been a Too much vacation. Yes. Yeah, so. <laughs> what do you so have for us this morning? We have Monterey chicken this morning. And you know the funny thing about it is with uh, school starting, uh, all our daughters are older now, but the first week of school is always a tough time. Moms are trying to figure out what to make. This is real simple. All I really did was take a chicken breast and, you know, six ounce, whatever you want. I get to use a little bit of uh, Kikkoman's teriyaki and a little bit of sesame oil for a little earthly, earthy feel. A little bit of olive oil and some garlic. Mix it all together, put it in a bag. You can do this at lunchtime. Pull it out, grill it. Then you just going to use a little bit of bacon, some portobellini mushrooms, red bell pepper, and a sweet onion. And these are really thin chicken yes, breasts. Yes. Do you pound them out? No, you, these I don't because they're, they're already come flattened, but you can pound them out. Okay. That's great. And they'll cook faster. And then uh, you're just going to melt the cheese on it. If they don't want cheese, you can put it without. This is a great flavor. A lot of flavor to this. Real easy to make. The other thing is roasted vegetables. And I use carrots, zucchini, broccoli. A lot of things that are real prominent in the garden right now. So flavorful. Yeah. On a cheap pan. Put your oven at 425. Spread a little olive oil on it. Some garlic. Salt and pepper. Roast them for about 20 minutes. Flip them over. Roast them again while you're fixing this. You've got a meal. The thing I love about this meal is the roasted vegetables add a lot, a lot of, there's a lot of volume to the meal, so right. it'll fill you up. It's a great way to get kids to try other vegetables because, you know, like you were talking earlier, yes. when you have kids that are picky, picky eaters, eaters or you were talking about your son who has texture things going mm -hmm. on. Man, I'll tell you, this is a great way to do it because everything's kind of the same texture. So. Exactly. And the chicken I love because along with my picky eaters, you can put it all together or you can get the cheese and the bacon and the chicken and they can eat it all separately as well. And, yes. And not only that, that's a good point. And the other thing about it is if the adults want to eat this and the children just want to eat chicken breast, I ran this by my daughter yesterday and she said it was good. So Put it she on a stick. It. She yes. liked it a lot, huh? Yes. Cut and it up, put it on a stick. They'll eat anything. Yeah, they will. And, you know, kids will eat the chicken breast a lot of times. But uh, I love the. I love it. It's beautiful. It's got a lot of flavor. And I really love the kind of, we're kind of transitioning into fall flavors. Mm -hmm. The roasted vegetables are phenomenal for that. And so. from start to finish, for all you teachers and assistant yes. principals and principals out there who are looking for a quick and easy start to finish. Uh, Less maybe, than an hour, Yeah, right? maybe half an hour. But Excellent. roasted vegetables take the longest. Perfect wow. when you're getting and, into And if it has routine. bacon, oh man, you can't go wrong there. Yeah, exactly. That's true. Exactly. So it's a, it's a good idea. And again, one of the things I'm trying to do with this dish is give you more time to uh, visit with your kids about their day. Hey Excellent. man, you were in, I see what you're doing there. Huh? Open the whole Monterey question. theme thing because yeah. you were in California in Monterey. Right. But you know, while you were gone, maybe people didn't get the opportunity to go to Facebook well, and they, like you. They actually did, and we're did really they? close. Oh, look we're at really you. close. We're only, close. We're only 32 likes away from 2,500. So go like Fantastic. it, go share it. Uh, I'm so excited just to get 2,500. And uh, so we we had a great time in Monterey. Um, I got to go to uh, Yountsville, California, and see the French Laundry, which is Thomas Keller, what? Chef Thomas Keller's place. Was and, uh, this a work trip or it a was. vacation Vinny trip? Yeah, our Mark on Produce is growing okay. out there by the Mark on Cooperative. Oh, nice. So I, uh, there's the first chef, sim our first chef summit they ever had, and so we had 12 chefs from around the country, and we got together, looked at the produce, and uh, had a great time. And one of those great perks for working for Benny. Hey, Keith put that bacon down. Hey, so, bud, you're the best. Yeah, I did you what I could. Have a little uh, bacon right here. Go ahead, go ahead and have a piece. Stick around. So much more of day break still to come. <laughs> We're gonna eat bacon. <laughs> In this increasingly fast-paced digital